Hi, I'm Kyle, and welcome back to Bedtime Verses with Kyle. Just a little poetry to help you get ready for bed. And please go over to my YouTube, at the Kyle Derrick, and give me a follow there for the full videos. Tonight, we're back with John Milton, and this is The Banishment. So it's after Adam and Eve have eaten of the tree of knowledge and must leave Eden. The Banishment. So spake our mother Eve, and Adam heard well pleased, but answered not. For now too nigh the archangels stood, and from the other hill to their fixed station, all in bright array, the cherubim descended, on the ground gliding meteorous as evening mist risen from a river o'er the marish glides, and gathers ground fast at the laborer's heel, homeward returning, high in front advanced, the brandished sword of God before them blazed, fierce as a comet, which with torrid heat and vapor as the Libyan era dust began to parch that temperate clime, whereat in either hand the hastening angel caught our lingering parents, and to the eastern gate led them direct, and down the cliff as fast to the subjected plain, then disappeared. They, looking back, all the eastern side beheld of paradise, so late their happy seat, waved over by that flaming brand, the gate with dreadful faces thronged and fiery arms. Some natural tears they dropped, but wiped them soon. The world was all before them, where to choose their place of rest, and providence their guide. They, hand in hand, with wandering steps and slow, through Eden took their solitary way. So, uh, God's angel just torched paradise there, and uh, now they have to go out into the real world and age and be cold and pay rent, you know? Was it worth it? I don't know. Thanks again for joining me for Bedtime Verses with Kyle. You can follow me here. And please subscribe to my YouTube, at the Kyle Derrick. And there'll be new readings every weekday night at 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Also, check me out as Drago on Bakugan, which is now on Netflix. Good night. Sleep tight. <laughs>